Hi, and welcome back. In the last video, we learned that a pulley is a wheel with a groove in it, and that it is used to increase mechanical advantage while decreasing the amount of effort or work that you need to do to lift or raise a load. In this video, we're going to look at compound pulleys and how pulleys work together. So in this first example, we can see we have a single fixed pulley. That means you have one pulley that is attached at one point and does not move. You can use it to change the mechanical direction of a load. So we can see that by lifting the load up, we just pull down, changing the mechanical direction. You can use pulleys though to increase your mechanical advantage and not just to change direction. An example would be a fixed pulley combined with a movable pulley. So by pulling on this rope arm, it requires less effort to raise the load and we change the mechanical direction. But you have to pull twice as much rope to have that reduced effort. You can even further compound this by adding a third pulley. So we have two movable pulleys and one fixed pulley. So I pull on this and it requires a third of the effort needed to raise the load, but it doesn't move very far. You have to pull twice, if not three times the amount of rope to raise the load, but with less effort. So that means I, as a smaller person with not very big muscles, can lift really heavy things by using pulleys. And now you know a little bit more about compounding pulleys.